If you play American style Mahjong, you might have considered playing in a tournament, but maybe shied away from it because of the pressure to play a timed game. You got to play 12 minute games comfortably to play in a tournament and not completely stress out, of course. Well, you can prepare yourself by doing an exercise that I call Charleston Sprints. What I like to do is set up a mock Charleston so that I can practice making quick decisions. I try to make decisions in under two minutes as an advanced player. If you're an intermediate player, try to make decisions in under three minutes. And if you're a beginner, try to make decisions in under four minutes and then push yourself to improve your time. That is a really great way to desensitize yourself from the pressure of the clock. It's worked for me. And if you give it a try, if you have tiles at home, let me know if it helps you. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. I have my smartphone with a stopwatch app on it. We're going to do five laps. Laps one, three, and five will be sprints. Laps two and four will be set up. We're just going to say we're the dealer for these, so I'm going to get 14 tiles. And then I'll set up a Charleston, a mock Charleston. This is just for practice. It's not exactly like what you would get if you're playing with real people, but this is just for practice. I always like to look at multiples. We have two, five, six, three, four, five, six, five, six, seven, eight. I think that's where I would start. Five, six, seven, eight. I would break up the two dot or two bam here. Five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, four, five. Let's see. We need a three, a two. We need a tile because I'm not passing a pair. Uh, let's see. Let's give up the eight. If you get a joker, just exchange it. So there's a three, that's not gonna be helpful. We have tiles we can pass. You know what? I think I would break up this pair of twos. We got one, doesn't help. Green, I don't know if that's gonna help or not. Let's pass these three. Nine, five, six, seven, nine. There's a green, there's a multiple now. Let's see, let's give up the four. Let's pass these three. Nines, let's pass these three. We're looking for consecutive. Two, here's a pair now, nine. Maybe three, six, nine. We can pass these three and we don't have to make a choice yet. There's a five and a dragon and a south. Okay, we have, oh, I forgot about this one all along. Okay, so we have a green nine, five, five, six, five, six, joker bait, nine. Let's pass these three. Okay, that was a bit rough. So we ended up with five, six, five, six with joker bait. I think if I had to pick a hand, I would probably play the pung hand concealed under consecutive run. I'd probably hold the four and this as joker bait. I would start by discarding the white dragon followed by the wind and then the nines. So I would stick with four, five, six consecutive run. If you would have done something different, write sprint one and what you would have done. And let's go on to the next one. That one was terrible. Two minutes, 25 seconds. I went over. 
we're going to have to make up some time. Look at these dragons. I think I would try for maybe a 369. 369 or like numbers with sixes. Let's give up these wins. Let's go ahead and pass these three. There's a dragon. Look at all those dragons. And we have no eights, ones, and twos. Oh, we gave up a two. Okay, let's give up these three. There's a six. I'm thinking dragons with sixes. Let's break up that east and pass these three. There's a flower. One, nine, east. Red. Tiles to pass. Tiles we can pass. Red. We don't need all the reds. We only need three for the dragon hand. Let's see. Maybe we should have played wins with dragons. Let's keep it and discard these three. Maybe we can get some wins back. lap okay you know what i would do i'd switch to news with dragons joker bait or i'd play a quint maybe that's what i would do too east six red i'd say we're between a quint and news with dragons we probably have four discards either way if we played a quint we'd have to throw this away if we played news with dragons we'd have to throw these away so we're between four and five discards but i don't think that was too bad look at these dragons oh my goodness that's crazy all right let's do one more One, two, I'm thinking consecutive or a year with these wins, maybe. Consecutive one, two, three, or a year hand. Let's see if we can get rid of some tiles now. Let's discard these three. Did I start my, oh, I forgot to start my, my lap. We gotta start over. Let's see, let me just start here. Two and four, okay, lap. I'd say that's about right. Let's pass. Okay, we got a two, four, five tiles to pass, although this two could maybe help. One, two, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, let's give up the five. Usually numbers in a range of four works. If you get a joker, just exchange it. So there's a one and a two, three. We have one tile. Now we look at maybe a hand. Here's almost news. One, two, one, two, three, four. 
Let's pass the dragon, the four. Let's see, we could do east and west with twos. Let's pass the three. Oh, a pair of dragons, look at that. So let's keep that past the three. We could pass this even. Maybe we could play the news, consecutive news hand. Dragon, flower, seven. This didn't come in. Maybe we could play news with dragons. Let's give up these three. Dragon, three to pass. We don't need those. Let's pass these three. Maybe we'll get a wind back. No wind. Okay, so yeah, we have work to do here. Five discards. But we're playing a completely different hand. News with dragons. I'd go for it. Five discards. We got work to do. Let's see how things went with time. Well, those were a bit interesting. I don't think I made it with timing, though. A couple of those started in a completely different category and ended up with winds and dragons. Two of them. All right, let's see what the timing was. Sprint one. Two minutes and 25 seconds. Sprint two. One minute 58. Sprint three. One minute 53. And I know on one of those, I forgot to turn it on. So that may or may not have made it. But I think it was a good exercise. If you have a set of tiles at home, give this exercise a try and let me know if it helps you make faster decisions. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, click subscribe. Then click the bell so you get notification for when I post new videos. That way you won't miss an opportunity to maybe learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next Charleston Sprints, for American-style Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules, may all your picks be keepers.